New York Export Opus Jazz is a ballet choreographed by Jerome Robbins with music by Robert Prince. Opus Jazz is iconic because it's a ballet in sneakers. It involves a lot of dance moves from popular dancing from the urban youth of the 1950s. We're having so much fun on stage together that we often forget that the audience is even there. I'm Kristen Sagan and I am a dancer with New York City Ballet. This season, I did Raymonda variations at the beginning of the program, and I was in a pink tutu with a high bun and a wreath around my head and point shoes, and I did classical variation where I had to turn and hop on point, and then after that, I had to put on sneakers and a ponytail and do opus jazz. So it was definitely a weird transition to go from a point shoe to a sneaker. You have to shake out all of that classical ballet and just forget what you just did on stage and then come out and do something completely different than what you already did in the program. In the first movement, Jerome Robbins introduces the jazz movement that's kind of like a variation on a theme that he expands on throughout the rest of the ballet. The second movement starts off with three guys and then they are joined by a woman. I think it's a power play between male aggression and female empowerment. It's pushed by very strong percussion and horns. The third movement is kind of just a bunch of young people hanging out. In a lot of Robin's ballets, dancers are performing for each other instead of performing for the audience, like in a Balanchine ballet. When you're standing on the side watching other dancers, you feel like part of a community, part of like a group of friends just hanging out and dancing together. The fourth movement is actually my favorite, just in its simplicity. And I think it shows a first love type of encounter that a lot of people experience when they're young and meeting new people for the first time. I would definitely love to dance that role one day. In the fifth movement, I get to dance with two of my very good friends. I think that's why it's so much fun to dance, because it's just the three of us dancing together, and we get to shake our hips and shake our shoulders at the boys who are watching us. Every show, we have a ritual. We form a circle with everybody in the cast, and we place a new dancer who's never done the ballet before in the middle, and we just push them around and they have to trust us. In the core of New York City Ballet, it feels like a giant team. We're all individuals, but we're all trying to work together to present to the audience something spectacular. The same thing applies to being in the core in Opus Jazz, but it's a little different because we can kind of add our own individuality to it. The audience loves Opus Jazz. It just makes you want to go out there and dance. <laughs>